What's up, YouTube? JG here. Now I just uh, finished watching Crisis on Infinite Earths. All right, it's so exciting. Okay, it's so exciting to watch. Um, I'm gonna give my take right now on how uh, on how the Arrowverse will be. Okay, this is my. Ito, ito ang uh, siguro honest opinion ko of how uh, of how the Arrowverse. Uh, of how the entire Arrowverse will run from now on. Okay, now I'm sure you've seen uh, reports or videos on you, other videos on YouTube that says that um, this and that, this and that. But <clears throat> here's my take on it. Okay, you've seen if you guys have seen part four, uh, that would be Arrow season eight, episode eight. Okay, Ezra Miller appeared. In the Justice League Flash, okay, uh, he had the, uh, what's it called, this, um, a mirror spat with, uh, with Grant Gustin, the TV Flash, okay. Now, then suddenly, he suddenly disappears, uh, realizing something, he suddenly disappears, suddenly disappears, okay. Here is my, um, uh, here's my theory on it. DC won't probably be making another Justice League movie because of what happened to the Ezra Miller Flash on part, in part four. They might not make another. Uh, they might not make another Justice League movie. I don't know. All right. Now, uh, everybody knows that Wonder Woman 1984 will be will be shown this year, and Aquaman. I think Aquaman two will be next year. Will be next year or two years from now. I don't know. They had, uh, they haven't. I I think they haven't confirmed it yet. But this is my theory. They might not make another. Uh, they might not make another Justice League movie, all right? Because of uh, well, uh, based on what happened to the Ezra Miller Flash in Part Four. Now, here's the thing that that supports my theory. The aftermath in Part Five, the the final one, right? So Barry Allen reveals a uh, a huge table with uh with seven seats, right? This was how the Justice League cartoons uh the table uh in the Justice League cartoon looked like almost, all right? So I'm 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 a fan of the Justice League cartoons actually, <laughs> Justice League season one and Justice League Unlimited. All right, I'm a big fan of that. So. They're, they're probably forming their own Justice League. Alright? So, ito yung support, ito yung support sa theory ko eh. That they might not be, that DC won't be pushing through with another Justice League movie kasi meron ng Justice League sa TV. Which is in the Arrowverse right now. Yun ang kumbaga pinaka aftermath eh. And they're reserving one seat for the Green Arrow. So, that's probably that's probably the Easter egg for Green Arrow and the Canaries. I say, well, we all know that Oliver Queen is dead, so the original Green Arrow is dead. So they may be expecting uh, his daughter Mia to replace him as the Green Arrow. You nga, kasi confirmed na sa YouTube that Green Arrow and the Canaries will be uh, will be starting. I think will be starting production already this year, or uh, production has started. Uh, I think production has started already. All right, Link, uh, give me give me your comments. Okay, give me your comments on that. So, and they have, uh, I think, yeah, another part of the af another part of the aftermath was, a, there was a new multiverse. Okay, from their yung second uh, yung pangalawang time na tinaro nila anti monitor. That's I think that was the moment when the new multiverse was born. I say if you would remember Kanina part 5, okay? They started with just because of uh, Oliver's sacrifice, a new earth was formed. So kumbaga pinagsama-sama na sila sa earth na to. And yun nga with when they defeated the anti-monitor for the second time, so 2-0, okay? Kawawa naman si Anti-Monitor. Zero to. <laughs> Probably the, arguably the most powerful being in the universe. Being defeated. Being defeated twice. 
by the arrow verse heroes. <laughs> Sakit. Okay? So, at that moment, a new multiverse was born. Alright? So, kumaga, yeah, Easter egg na rin for future Arrowverse shows. Like, nga, uh, I, I don't know if you caught a glimpse of it. Stargirl and the Green Lantern Corps. You know, the Green Lantern Corps is what I'm, uh, is what I'm looking forward to. Eh. That Easter egg, okay? It's either Green Lantern or the Green Lantern Corps. Then, there was another Easter egg which involved the Swamp Thing. Eh, yung pin, yung the yung parang ta, yung parang tao ba yun? Yung entity na pinakita nila before they showed uh, the Brandon Routh Superman again. Yung parang 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 monster talaga yung chura. That was the Swamp Thing, folks. <laughs> that was the Swamp Thing. Okay? So, he lives in another Earth. Then, of course, Earth 96, yung the brand, yung Superman ni Brandon Routh. Actually, if you would uh, if you follow if you follow DC sa comics the Superman that Brandon Roth played in Crisis was the Kingdom Come Superman kita nyo yung logo iba mas uh, what you call this mas dark ang dating that was the Kingdom Come Superman so Earth 96 has its own Superman so here's another theory here's another theory of mine there will be of course well it's well if you if, kung ibibase natin sa part 5 There will be two Supermans In the new Arrowverse Okay So Brandon Routh now has a chance to 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 play Superman again Not just for Crisis But outside of But after Crisis Because of his alter ego so, we, we all know Brandon Routh is the atom Sa Arrowverse Sa members of Legends diba? But we all know But be before the atom He played Superman In Superman Returns Dito he was the Kingdom Come Superman. Okay? So, na, kumaga, na-revive yung Earth ng Superman na yun. So, there's a good chance that he will play that Superman again. Kaya, dalawa silang Superman. Okay? So, Brandon Ralph at si Tyler Hecklin. Now, it's also been announced that uh, there, there, there was also an Easter egg for the Tyler Hecklin Superman. Superman and Lois. Okay, Superman and Lois. Doon, uh, I don't, I think you, uh, you missed that. Tinawagan siya ni Lois Lane. Sinabi na, uh, nagbigay ng hit na dalawa na anak nila. Alright? So, this will be, this will be a very, that will be a very interest, interesting twist to the Superman storyline. Uh, the fact that Superman is a family man now. Okay? So, Superman and Lois, yeah, Aabangan ko yan. <laughs> Aabangan ko yan. Superman and Lois. So, yeah. Pagkata naging ending. Okay? Uh, talagang pinaghandaan ng DC ito. Tsaka na uh, the CW. The, uh, the cable channel that is uh, currently producing all the Arrowverse shows. But, uh, it was a fitting, it was actually a fitting salute to uh, to Oliver Queen. To the original green, to the first Green Arrow, which is of course which is played by Stephen Amell. Kung baga, ang ganda yung, maganda yung ginawa nilang, uh, yung, yung ginawa nilang tribute for, for the first Green Arrow. Okay? Medyo naiyak ako dun. <laughs> Kasi, well, Arrow was the show that started, kaya nga Arrowverse ang, Arrowverse ang pangalan ng ano eh, pangalan ng set ng shows na yun eh. Because, Arrow was the show that started it all. And we all know that in two weeks, right? In two weeks, Arrow will be ending. Okay? So, you guys better not miss the last, the final two episodes of Arrow. Right? The show that started the Arrowverse. Okay? So, yun ang take ko. Well, wow. Very cool. Very cool yung ano, last two parts. Alright? It was worth the wait. Okay? It was worth the wait. Now, I have no idea if uh, if Warner TV. Uh, I watch it through Warner TV, okay, cable, cable channel din siya. I don't know if Warner TV will show the new um, the new uh, the new Arrowverse shows, you know, Star Girl, uh, Superman and Lois, 
Ang confirm lang yata yan, Stargirl tsaka Superman and Lois. I don't know kung confirm na yung Green Lantern eh. Uh, pero, if you could base it, again, if you could base it on on the final on the final half of part 5, mukhang itutuloy nila eh. Mukhang nagbigay na ng hint ang DC that they are that they're that they plan to push through with the um uh, excuse me, with Swamp Thing, the Green Lantern Corps. I don't know, but that either Green Lantern Corps or just Green Lantern. Now, we have no idea which Green Lantern ang issue showcase nila. Okay? But, if you would ask me, I would focus on the Green Lantern Corps. Alright? I would focus on the Green Lantern Corps kasi Green Lantern has its own, has its own universe eh. Has its own, has its own broad, has its own, uh, what you call this? Has a big storyline by itself, eh. Diba? There have been a lot of Green Lanterns on, of Earth, okay? That represented Earth. So, yeah. Hmm, those are the shows to watch, okay? The Arrowverse, now, now let's not be, uh, Let's not be lamenting on uh, on uh, the end of Arrow. Tandaan nyo, Arrow will be ending in two weeks. But, I think probably two, three, maybe even four will take it. Four new shows. Four new Arrowverse shows will take its place. At maximum. Maximum four. Okay? Confirm lang Stargirl at saka Superman and Lois eh. I think. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm not, well, I'm not sure. But, Leave a comment below, okay? Leave a comment to uh, to clarify to clarify on that, okay? So yeah, I'll be um, <laughs> I'll be washing the dishes now, okay? Dapat kanina ko pag ginawa ito, but I I, I even uh, I even saw the catch up in the first three parts, kasi inulit kanine. So yeah, that's my take on the Arrowverse. Catch you later, guys.